a role model. She revolutionized our sport, which I think carried over into other sports, particularly for women athletes. I, I think that she really just changed what it means, not only to be a female athlete, but to be Uh, her first major singles trophy back in 1999 to watch the development, the growth, the evolution and watch week after still had such a push and that as you called it the Serena effect. It's pulling people into the game and the way that Tiger Woods did years ago that maybe otherwise wouldn't have been drawn to this particular game. Particularly from a celebrity perspective and aspect. Right. I mean everyone wants to come out. Everyone wants to be in the presence of greatness. Yes. And Serena has proven that. You know, I had the opportunity to cover Serena years ago when I did a different U.S. Open. You know that. It is a different sport now. When you look at the fans that come out to cheer on these competitors, these players, not only is there more diversity in the sport because of Serena. Incredible weekend for her, and we know the impact she's had, not only in the game of basketball, but off the court as well. Tracy, that's what it is. Team development for the New Orleans Pelicans in breaking barriers and showing roles of now individuals can say, I want to be in a front office. I want to do this. She's going to be running a team before we know it. You know, she speaks from the soul, not just the heart, but from the soul and everything she does. And it's about making others around her better. She said it's my mom's moment more than anyone else's. She yes. talked a lot about that. She's so proud of, of what her mom has been able to do for her, and she's paying it forward with what she's been able to do with her kids. And that and her mother said you walk into every... Sue Bird and another legend who is retiring, and Sarah, you've been around the game a long time and been able to see her. What kind of legacy is she going to I, I was watching her. I was watching both of them, playing with them on the court. I'm, we're giving a lot of love to UConn here. <laughs> <laughs> Girls are my kind of guys, basically. <laughs> and so uh, it was awesome. And, and let me just, say, and being able to bring my family, my three boys, my husband who graduated Michigan, uh, who's to millions of people I get to every Sunday, that was probably the most nervous wow. I've ever been. But it was such an incredible experience. And of course, doing it. You got to win. Time. But that's phenomenal. Congratulations. Yeah. Thanks, what a great so experience. Fun. Thanks, guys. It really was. I appreciate it. And so you made three little Michigan fans out of it, right? They might have already been. Oh, my all God. Three boys. Are now my youngest <laughs> one is a diehard. I mean, yes. How about this, though, from Washington? I'm going to tell my kids I'm going to lay you out if you do anything <laughs> wrong. And finally, a big congratulations to our wonderful producer, Julie.